Hello, you welcome to another episode of Wisdom for Living. My name is Femi Drojai. Today I want to talk to you about how to attract the right man or how to keep the right man if you have him. First, quickly, let's go to the fact that um, don't stress yourself. The fact that you are a woman is attractive to a man. A lot of young people, you know, they say, I'm not finding a lot of young girls. I'm not finding enough. I want to do. No, the fact that you are a girl, the fact that you are even young is attractive in itself. So let's get that out of the way. Now, it is good to make up, to wear fine dresses, etc., etc., you know. But there are some things that are more important than makeup and fine dresses that will attract and keep the right man. First is industry. It's industry. By industry, I mean that, babe, go and find work. Go and get something doing. You understand? Go and get something doing. If you are still confused about whether a man, a woman should walk, etc., etc., I would advise you, right? Take there's there's a book called the Bible, right? Go to Proverbs 31 and see what a woman is supposed to do. Let's not be confused about it. When God created man and woman, he gave them work to do. You understand? <laughs> So, and he said it's the work of our hands that what? It will bless. So, everybody should go and walk. He that does not walk should not eat. That's what the Holy Book says. So, the first thing in keeping, an, in keeping a right man or attracting the right man is industry. Babe, go and find work. It is in the place of your labor that you will have the respect and honor that you deserve. Trust me. Men want girls women who are hard working so number one is industry number two is um be honest and above board men want those they can trust they can rely on be honest and above board this quality is more important than being beautiful be honest and above board. And you'll be able to keep your man. You'll be able to attract the right man. As I said, men want women they can trust. Men want women they can rely on. And men will see you as able to look and nurture their children. Be honest and be above board in everything you do. Let the man know that. That is an attraction that is more than being beautiful. Another point is, um, don't be ashamed to show him that you genuinely love him. See, this is about your life. It's not what you read in social media. I'm talking about real life situations here. Don't be ashamed to show him that you genuinely love him. If you are just looking for a man, you are desperate for a man because you need to have a man, the man will know. And that relationship will not work or may not work. You understand? Uh -huh. Now, be committed to your faith. Whether you're a Muslim, you're a Christian, whatever faith that you belong to, be committed to it. Right? Um, let the man know that above any other thing, your faith in God comes first. That will translate to your integrity. You understand? And integrity, integrity is a scarce commodity. We are still talking about how to attract the right man and or to keep him. Right? Be a person that seeks peace first. Nobody likes, nobody likes a troublemaker. You must have heard somewhere that a man needs peace. Nobody wants your troublemaking attitude though. 
be someone that seeks peace first in everything you do. And your man will respect you for that. I may even die for you. Um, be his true friend. Be his gist partner. You understand? Be his true friend. Be his gist partner. Take an interest in what he does. Even though you don't even like it, like football. Now, men, generally, men like football. Take a passing interest in it. If you know you are trying, you understand, to like what he likes. And we appreciate you for it and love you. The time is so short to talk about um, everything you need to attract the right man and to keep him. I'm sure in other episodes of Wisdom for Living, we shall treat it. Thank you. God bless you. As you keep or as you attract the right man.